So because this is an IP-based phone system, we've actually got a suite of applications that links your desktop PC to your desk phone. So uh, the suite is called the Smart Call Connectors. So I'll, I'll show an example of this. So for an incoming call, if James can place a, a call to my desk phone here, we see a pop-up on incoming calls which shows the name, extension number, and actually company name details that it's actually taken from my Microsoft address book. I can click the answer, and that's actually answered the call, not on my PC, but actually at my desk phone. So you can see on the 7960 here, we have the call answered. And again, with my, a click of my mouse, I can hang that call up as well, or put it on hold, or send it to voicemail. So the other thing that the call connector does is it puts a toolbar into my internet browser or my Outlook address, uh, Outlook um, email client. So the various sections of the toolbar you can see here, this is a quick dial box. So I can just tap a number in here and it will place a very quick call from my desk phone out to a phone over there. So again, I'll hang that up with a click of the mouse. So working along the toolbar, I have uh, a pickup button, a call pickup button, a call forward button. This shows me the status of the line. So if I get an incoming call, that goes active. Uh, group pickup, and this is a contacts button. When I hit the contacts button, it shows me a list of, of contacts, uh, either from my address book, or here, I, I've also got a number of tabs where if I hit the log file, I can see the missed call that I got just now from David. So another option here is I can either double click on David to call him back. I could go to my Outlook address book and look David up in here. And from my address book directly, double click and call him back. And another tab I have on this part of Call Connector is I've got some quick speed dials here. They're very quick to add based on just a right click of the mouse button. Another feature of the Call Connector is up here I can hit a button which hypertexts any uh, number that looks like a telephone number on the screen of the internet browser. So on any web page, it will activate any telephone numbers. So I can click on those, and it will place a call to those from my desk phone. Call Connector also supports an instant messenger client, where I could, for instance, send a quick message to James to see if James is there, or ask him a quick question. If he is there, obviously, I can place a quick call to him, etc. Um, so that can save me a lot of time um, yeah, without disrupting James too much, and I know he's available. Uh, I can also, from that same client, instantly access my voicemail and just hit the button to play the voicemail messages. So if I'm using William's PC here, I've got the present screen here, and if I click on this tab, I can see my voicemails. So I see I've got one from uh, David here, so I quickly play that. Hi there, Will. Yeah, it's Patrick here. Could you get back to me as soon as you can? Thanks, mate.